Hi, Jeff here with Corsair. I'm gonna give you a quick tour of the Carbide Series Air 540 case. The Air 540 has a unique new design to provide outstanding cooling. Our direct airflow path design works on the principle that the components that generate the most heat should receive the coldest, most direct airflow from outside the chassis. The Carbide Air 540 utilizes dual chambers to deliver cooler air to your CPU, graphics cards, motherboard, and memory without your drives or power supply getting in the way of the airflow. The airflow path is effectively a straight line, drawing cool air directly to the components. Let's take a closer look at the airflow. The mesh top and front slide out easily, like this. This low restriction dust filter has magnetic mounts and removes easily for maintenance. Behind that, the two front 140mm intake fans are Corsair Air Series AF140L models. They're based on the award-winning AF140 and have custom-molded, ultra-thin blades to move a lot of air with lower turbulence. The Air 540 has lots of cooling expansion flexibility. If you like, you can replace the AF140L fans with a 240mm, 280mm, or even a 360mm radiator. In fact, there's even room in the front of the chassis for the fans, so you can still install a radiator in a push-pull configuration. Up on top, you can add a 240mm or 280mm radiator. And as you imagine, this gives you the potential for a pretty impressive custom air cooling or water cooling setup, and our cable routing system makes it easy to hide pumps and tubing out of the way. The side panels use thumb screws, so just like with all Corsair cases, you don't need to grab a screwdriver to get into the case. Moving the power supply and SSD and optical drive cages to their own chamber not only improves cooling and lowers the noise, but saves space and makes the Air 540 remarkably flexible for its compact size. There are eight PCIe expansion slots, and you can fit graphics cards up to 320 millimeters in length. The PCIe mounts are tool-free, and both of the 3.5-inch hard drive bays have hot swap connectors. Now let's take a look at the other chamber. Again, the efficient design makes good use of the case's dimensions. There are two optical drive bays and two SSD bays. They're all tool-free, and you can fit extra long power supplies of up to 200 millimeters in length. Notice the CPU backplate cutout. It makes cooling upgrades a lot easier. The rear exhaust fan is also a 140mm Air Series AF140L. And up front, you'll find two USB 3.0 ports, headphone, microphone jacks, power, and reset switches. Thanks for watching, and if you have any questions, here's how to reach us.